This is the heart of America's military power in the Middle East. One. Qatar's Al Udaid Air Base hosts everything from B 52s, fighter jets, and refueling aircrafts. But in order for these bombers to reach their targets, they require an air base like Al Udaid, which is close enough to many areas in the Middle East and Asia, with the ability to provide logistical support. Al Udaid is part of the American Central Command Area of Responsibility. This area extends from Kazakhstan in the north to Yemen in the south and from Pakistan in the east to Egypt in the west. If you look at CENTCOM on a map, uh, Qatar falls roughly in the center of that map. And so uh, the capabilities here allow us to reach out on order to any corner of the CENTCOM region. Out of value deed, we strike or we fly uh, uh, aircraft across a range of capabilities. So tankers, airlift, paramedical evac. Uh, surveillance, reconnaissance, and then strike aircraft. So all of those things are layered together uh, through the orders of the Combined Air Operations Center to have those effects on target and the persistence to be able to go after ISIS on demand when the targets arise. U.S. forces do not work alone in al Udaid. They are in a coalition of more than 20 countries. One of them is the United Kingdom. The air base has sophisticated systems and equipment installed to meet everyone's requirement. It will be difficult to replicate just the complexity and sophistication of what we all have here at Al Udeed because of the investment over time, the investment in money, the investment in people. Almost a thousand people work in the air operations center 24 hours a day on shift. So you can't just, as we would say in the UK, up sticks and then go and relocate it somewhere else easily. It's, it's important to us and the investment that, that all of us, Americans, UK, coalition friends, have put into the Air Operations Centre, have put into Al Udeed, tells you how important it is and, and we're here for the long haul. Al Udeed has plenty of space for big bombers, something that is not available in many air bases in the region. And the base's location, was a factor in the decision to bring these bombers here. Al Udaid Air Base is considered a safe place for big bombers like the B-52 to operate from. These bombers provide air power to the region. Mahmoud Alkan, Al Jazeera, Al Udaid Air Base in Qatar.